And yes, that really was the apparently kid romping around the Wayne County Fairgrounds today. The fair near Honesdale is where we first met Noah Ritter last summer. He gave us an interview that evening, and his life hasn't been the same since. Newswatch 16's Clay Lepard got to do the midway with Noah one year later. How much can things change in a year? Here at the Wayne County Fair near Honesdale, there probably might not be a better person to ask than Noah Ritter. You see, last year, this happened. I never ever be on live television. Are you excited? Yeah, and apparently I already went down the super slide. When I went down the wall, I was scared half to death. Everything. Which led to this. I used to like the Giants, but my grandfather brainwashed me into, into liking the Steelers. <laughs> and this. Now Noah Ritter is back, where it all started. So of course we had to go to the teacups where we interviewed him last year. How have things uh, changed in a year for you? Um, well I'm six and I have two iPads, one, one from Ellen and one that my grandpa bought me. More than that, evidently he attracts quite the crowd now. Say hi. Ah, oh, great. Good job. But we couldn't stop there. It was off to the super slide. You say go. Go. Go, go, go. Oh, here we go. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Thanks, bud. I'm a big fan of you. A year later and a newfound fan base, and yet still the same kid at the fair. Where's the better pizza, here or, or L.A.? <laughs> Look to see Noah continue his appearances on the Ellen DeGeneres show. Clay Lepard, Newswatch 16, Wayne County.